motoring seems to be becoming more expensive as the days go by. Well, this car is powered by a fuel which is a lot cheaper than petrol because although there's an ordinary 1600cc engine in here, this car is coal-powered. Yeah, and the coal uh, is in the back. It's not in the boot or in the petrol tank. It's in this uh, sort of steel uh, drum here. Now, uh, inside this hopper is 45 pounds of anthracite. Uh, it drops gradually through to the bottom, and at the bottom there's a small furnace uh, in there. In fact, it, it, it's quite warm. Now, inside the boot is a little tin that's full of water. Now, this is a, a drip feed to the coal. It comes down through this pipe uh, into the furnace, and it mixes with the burning anthracite to form a hydrogen gas, which is obviously different from the uh, gas you get out of a gas stove. But the, the car still uses petrol, and it's been invented by Mr. Purser and, uh, from Kings Norton. He started experimenting last summer with this model. Well, this uh, sort of gas-making unit, in fact, is made out of three old paint tins. Um, the first fuel that Mr. Purser tried in it was uh, the wood of some apple trees that he happened to be pruning at the time. Well, even that was enough fuel for um, a 100cc engine, this one here, and uh, as far as the engine was concerned, gas was as good as petrol vapour. So the next thing to do was try it out in a full-size car. Well, when the gas uh, forms inside the cylinder, it comes through a pipe, and it's very hot as well. So it's got to go through this heat exchanger. Once it's gone through there, it then goes underneath the car and through up to the underneath the bonnet through this pipe here there's an air control here and then eventually it goes through the air cleaner straight down into the car and then into the engine and of course uh, using gas uh, it works out quite quite cheap in fact because that hopper full of 45 pounds of anthracite will take it about 100 miles so it works out really a lot cheaper than petrol. Right, if you all like to get in, it's quite a gas, really. Time for a ride. <laughs> Sorry, I shouldn't have get in. <laughs> <laughs> come on, petrol. In. Hey, come on. Come, come on. on. Right. Everybody Very in. Oh, right. That's a good girl. We'll have to get a gas power. <laughs> <laughs> so, in that case, we'll see you on Thursday. <laughs>